In this video, I'm going to break down my top 10 AI writing tools, because being able to write effectively is an essential skill if you want to get top grades, grow an audience, or make money online. Whether you're writing an essay, creating captions for social media, or putting together an irresistible offer for a sales page, having a go-to writing system will help you create high-quality content while avoiding writer's block and saving you tons of time. The problem is that with the GPT API openly available, AI-powered copywriting tools are absolutely everywhere. If you search Google or look through AppSumo or Product Hunt, it can be really difficult to figure out which is the best for you, and you can end up spending more time deciding rather than actually writing. So to help you out, I signed up to as many free AI copywriting websites as I could find and used their free tiers to write blog posts over a week-long period to figure out which were the easiest and most effective to create content with. I then put together a list of what I consider to be the 10 best AI writing tools that you can use without having to pay anything, and I've even included a bonus 11th and 12th at the end of the video with my personal take on what the best AI writing tool is and why, so make sure you stick around. Now hit that subscribe button and let's get into it. Kicking things off is Reword. As you'll see, this is a little bit different to other AI writing tools on the list. Rather than just responding to prompts, Reword is unique because you can actually train the AI using your existing articles and your writing style. One of the major issues with AI-generated content is that it isn't unique and lacks some of the opinion and creativity of a human writer. Reword tries to improve upon this by asking you to prime the AI by giving it information about your readers and what you write about in general. You can then either manually upload examples of your writing or, and this is where Reword really comes into its own, connect it up to Google Search Console. Now, when connected to GSC, Reword will be able to understand the search intent behind your articles and analyze click-through rates, which is a killer feature if you're growing an online blog. The writing interface is nice and minimalist too, and I love the UX because it's just so simple. You're encouraged to brainstorm titles and sections for your article in the right-hand bar, and Reword will then offer a selection of suggested titles and sections for you to choose from, which massively reduces your research time. The actual writer has three quick launch AI buttons, AI Enrich, Rephrase, and Shorten, and then has AI Command, which opens the right-hand window, where you can then enter prompts or use templates. One of my favorite functions is to select a chunk of text and then use the prompt, edit in a natural internal link, and then you insert your link. This will then find an appropriate place to enter a link in your article, and you can specify SEO-related keywords too. Adding links can be really time consuming, and this is a great feature if you have your own blog. Reword has two big pluses to it. Firstly, its free tier and low pricing for page users makes it super accessible. And secondly, that ability to train and personalization means that the content produced is less generic. Reword's only downside is that it's run by a small team, so you're not going to get all the additional features of some of the larger companies that we'll see later on in the list. The free tier for Reword offers unlimited AI assistance with basic AI training and an article cap of up to four articles created a month, and the pro version starts at $48 per month. Copy AI provides a range of automated creativity tools to overcome writer's block, along with AI-generated templates that can jumpstart your writing projects. The platform also includes a long-form document editor that allows you to centralize your ideas and streamline your writing process. Copy AI's workflow includes AI-powered writing tips and ideas to help you create effective content. Copy AI features a chat interface similar to ChatGPT, but pairs this with a notes field on the right-hand side of the screen so that you can save your responses directly into your text editor. Unlike ChatGPT, the Copy Chatbot has the ability to scrape websites for public data, which means it can personalize emails from data on LinkedIn or summarize a YouTube video if you just supply the link. And it can even search PubMed if you want to supply links to research articles for academic research. The pop-up modal-based interface may not suit everyone's taste, but it is fairly simple and minimalist to use. Copy AI's biggest benefit is its pricing. It has a 2,000 word limit on its free plan and then unlimited words on its paid plan, which starts at $49 a month. Writer is an affordable AI-powered content writing platform that helps you generate content at scale for any niche. If you've never used an AI-powered writing tool, it's a good one to start with as its interface is incredibly simplistic. Its free tier offers up to 10,000 characters, not words, as well as AI-generated art. Unlimited characters will then set you back $39 a month. 
Writer has a built-in plagiarism detector to ensure any content created is original, which is a feature that lots of AI copywriting tools lack. Writer is quite basic, but it's a good entry level if you've not used tools before. Pseudowrite is an AI writing tool that's gone in big on unique UX and visual story writing tools. It's very user-friendly with an engaging aesthetic, and it uses prompt templates really effectively with large buttons automating key tasks like write, describe, rewrite, and more. Now, Pseudowrite's main audience is story writers, with prompts designed to generate ideas for characters, plot twists, and genres like romance or thriller. The writing layout is really clean, with a prompt window on the right-hand area and a really cool drag-and-drop interface. Pseudowrite's most unique features come in the form of its feedback, canvas, brainstorm, and visualize prompts. At the press of a button, feedback will give you simulated feedback from a reader persona to check what you've already written. Brainstorm will generate alternative words and character names for you to make your story more engaging, while Visualize will produce AI-generated art from your descriptions. Canvas is a separate brainstorming area where you can then generate alternative plot points, character secrets, and plot twists for inspiration and reference all in one place. If you're looking to write a novel, Pseudowrite is a great choice. Now, if you've used Notion before, you'll probably love Jenny because it borrows a lot from Notion's minimalist interface. When you start a new project, Jenny asks you whether you're a student writing an academic essay or a content creator writing copy for a blog. This then personalizes the tone and Jenny guides you through the writing process. Jenny comes with a plagiarism checker on paid plans and also has a citation generator to save you time. The free tier comes with 2,000 words a month or two blog posts a month, and then pricing scales up. WriteSonic has got a huge amount of features, as well as more in terms of customization. WriteSonic features a ChatGPT-style interface called ChatSonic and a generative art tool called Photosonic. ChatSonic has a really nice feature that allows you to select a persona for your AI from a drop-down menu to save you lots of time. Now, unlike other tools, WriteSonic allows you to edit some of the internal workings of its API. For example, in Photosonic, the AI art tool, you can easily switch between Dolly and Stable Diffusion. In ChatSonic, you can include web scraping and even activate text-to-speech conversion if you wish. But one of WriteSonic's coolest features is its bulk editability, which is unfortunately just on page plans. If you have lots of content that needs to be written or edited, you can upload an Excel file, set the parameters, and then have everything written all at once. WriteSonic's vanilla editor is really nice too. There's a huge prompt library which is nicely organized with editor's choices, and each prompt has got a rating based on user feedback to help you find the best prompt for you. You can save your own prompts as well. When writing a new article, WriteSonic has a really user-friendly interface with a full-screen writing mode that has integrations to Surfer SEO, as well as a stepwise blog creation process which takes you from the blog title all the way down to writing paragraphs of text. There's even a one-click WordPress export and some really nice prompts, including creating copy for a whole landing page and a Twitter thread. WriteSonic's free tier gives you a generous 10,000 words, and there's a 30% discount on paid plans for students. The entry-level paid plan comes in at $12.67 per month, and that comes with 60,000 words, which is a little bit less than a Harry Potter novel, or around 61,000 blog posts per month. Now, I can't do a free top 10 list without mentioning ChatGPT. It's completely free, and its responses are excellent, provided you have a solid understanding of prompt engineering and you know how to use it. There are no prompt template buttons here, and at peak times you might get locked out for a while, but for the most part, it's excellent and it's completely free. ChatGPT Plus comes in at $20 per month and offers availability even when demand is high, faster response speeds, and priority access to new features like new GPT models when they're released. In my experience, the response time and availability is actually pretty good on the free tier, and when other paid solutions offer full text editing and prompt templates, you're probably best to stick with vanilla ChatGPT. As a quick extra here, you can also use the OpenAI Playground, which comes with some free credits, and it allows you to select from different language models too. If you go over the limit, you will then be charged, but it's a nice option to have, and if you have some engineering skills, the API is really easy to integrate into pretty much any text field, which is why we have so many AI writing startups at the moment. Like lots of note-taking apps, Notion has integrated generative AI into their platform, allowing users to create content directly from their Notion dashboard. Notion already has a really nice minimalist interface with the full screen mode making your writing area the center of your attention. Notion comes with a host of pre-configured prompt templates that can be activated at the click of a button and includes everything from grammar checking and translating to generating new text. You can also enter your own prompts too. 
For anyone using Notion as a second brain, the AI Writer is a great way to summarize your saved articles, expand upon ideas, or just improve the readability of an essay. Notion AI isn't designed for a specific use case, and there's no chat interface here, or ways to scrape the web or pull in SEO data, but if you're an existing Notion user, or your primary focus is on note-taking and basic writing, it's a really great option. Pricing starts at $8 per month, which is a nice entry point for an already great tool, and you can access a lot of this on Notion's free tier. ScaleNut combines AI writing with SEO research. It's comparable to using SEO tools like Surfer, but with the added benefit of not requiring the purchase of two separate tools. Simply input your desired keyword, and ScaleNut provides a document editor that focuses on your keyword, complete with a panel on the left displaying all your competitors. ScaleNut's workflow is very much for writers who are looking to optimize their search engine optimization and ensure they rank for keywords within the article that they're writing. It also comes with a Google Chrome extension, and if you use WordPress for your blog, it also has the ability to publish directly to your WordPress site. For this reason, the interface is a little bit more complex than other pure AI writing tools, and if you aren't already familiar with SEO and keywords and using Google Search Console, it's probably best to choose another writing tool and focus on producing high-quality original content. If you're searching for an all-in-one tool that includes SEO capabilities, however, and an unlimited word count, ScaleNut is a great choice. ScaleNet has a free forever tier which caps you at 2,000 words, and then the growth plan comes with unlimited words and starts at $29 a month. Quillbot is an awesome tool that has a few really unique features when it comes to writing. Top of the list is its paraphrasing tool that allows you to quickly enter text or upload a whole document and paraphrase and change the tone in a flash. Quillbot is designed for research and academic study, and its co-writer has some really nice features when it comes to researching and generating original content. Quillbot's research function and co-writer is able to pull in similar articles from the web and list out the key points and even the keywords. These can then be used to structure your own article. There's also a citation generator that allows you to reference these articles really quickly. Now, one drawback here is that although the co-writer will generate new content and rephrase existing text, there's no way to enter your own prompts to customize it. Beyond the co-writer, Quillbot also features a host of tools like grammar checkers and translators and even a summarizer, as well as a plagiarism checker, which is a really great function to check originality of your article, which is missing on many AI writers. Quillbot features plugins for Word if you want to work right from your documents, and also a Chrome extension so that you can use Quillbot on any web page. Quillbot features a free tier with an annual plan of $99 a year, which is excellent value for what you're getting. Okay, so just before I wrap up and give my opinions on the best free AI AI writing tools, I want to cover two bonus tools that didn't quite make the list. First up, if you're looking for an even simpler version of Quillbot, WordTune is really cool because it offers a free Chrome extension as well as a long-form document editor. One of the key features of WordTune is its ability to improve readability. It uses AI to suggest changes that can make your writing clearer and more concise. This feature can be particularly useful for those who struggle with wordy or convoluted writing. WordTune's prompt template buttons focus on rephrasing and changing the tone of what you've already written, with the UX showing a list of options for you to choose from. WordTune is a completely free browser extension and perfect for fine-tuning your work. Paid plans then start at $9.99 a month for unlimited rewrites and expanded tones. Unlike the other tools we've seen so far on this list, Jasper is trying to be an all-in-one platform offering everything covering generative AI, from art to text, but unfortunately it doesn't have a free tier and comes in as being quite expensive. Despite that, it has some awesome features if you're willing to pay, and it's interesting to see how these compare. Jasper has integrated chat into their interface like lots of other tools on this list have done to help you overcome writer's block. The chat interface is a little bit similar to Copy AI and Write Sonic, but lacks the ability to scrape external data. Jasper's prompts library is pretty expansive compared to other AI writing tools, with everything from writing a movie script to technical blog formats at the press of a button. Jasper's Chrome extension, which allows you to use generative AI on any web page, reduces the time required to application switch, and its integrations with tools like Surfer SEO are really helpful, even if the latter integration comes at an additional cost. Jasper also has image generation capabilities, though these come at an additional cost too. Jasper's main selling point may well be its community, however. Jasper has been able to grow quickly before the new wave of OpenAI API-powered apps, and it did this with effective marketing and a supportive Facebook community of copywriters helping each other to improve. Now, the actual responses output are exactly the same as any other AI copywriting tool that uses the GPT API. 
And so if this is your primary need, other solutions may produce the same results at a lower price point. And if you're looking for a complete solution, definitely try this against WriteSonic in terms of features and pricing. So what is the best AI writing tool in my opinion? Well, in creating the list, I focused on the three tiers available and looked specifically at the features and ease of use. This was a little bit of an epic quest as there are just so many out there and new ones arriving every single day. And so I discounted anything that was crazy expensive or where the UX was slow to get into. We want tools that get out of our way and help us to write as quickly as possible. So for me personally, I found that because it's free and very easy to use, I tended to default back to ChatGPT itself over free alternatives if I was doing things like brainstorming blog titles or simplifying text. For creating longer form blogs, I found that Reword, with its ability to train itself based on your existing posts, was really cool and its interface is very easy to use. In terms of academic writing, I think Quillbot or WordTune combined with something like Notion or Copy AI and its citations is super, super powerful. And if I was looking for an SEO specific tool for writing with more in-depth keyword features, ScaleNut is a great option, but isn't for the casual user. I also want to put an extra shout out to PseudoWrite, which is just so unique if you're looking to write a novel. Now, the overall thing that I took away from all of this is that there are lots of these tools out there and they pretty much have the same function. They all use similar APIs and it's more to do with the user interface and pricing than the actual output they produce. While they all generate content, you want to be producing unique and valuable content rather than spamming out AI generated text that lacks originality. And with Microsoft integrating GPT into Office 365, AI writing is becoming the norm. And so it's really important to choose a writing tool that saves you time over features you may not need and also ensuring that you dive into the prompts and understand prompt engineering. For this reason, I've put a link in the comments below to some of my prompt engineering templates that you can use and plug into any free tools to help you get the best results. And I've also added a couple of videos up here that you should dive into now, which cover prompt engineering in detail, which I definitely recommend checking out. Thanks so much for watching. Do hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed this video and I hope you found it useful and I'll catch you again next time.